This is amazing. Human trials begin for a drug that lets adults regrow teeth like kids. Uh, just a few days ago, I scanned through a, uh, a little brief saying that a dentist had found a way to regrow teeth by using frequency. And now this has to do with the drug. September will be a big month for people who've lost a tooth and wish they could regrow a new one like they did when they were kids. Following promising results in animal studies, Japanese researchers are set to begin human trials for a new drug that could regrow human teeth. Right now, there are a whole lot of ferrets and rats with a beautiful set of chompers that they otherwise would not have had if not for the experimental drug. The drug deactivates a protein known as uterine sensitization associated gene 1 or USAG1. It's a real pain in the ass for as far as proteins go because this one inhibits tooth growth. The drug aims to inhibit the inhibiting protein, letting new tooth growth flourish. They're trying to beat it at its own game. The first phase of human trials will be held at Kyoto University and Kitano Hospital in Japan and will involve 30 men ages 30 to 64 who are missing at least one molar tooth. The phase will last 11 months with plans to expand the study to children ages 2 to 7 with congenital tooth deficiencies. Eventually, the experiment will expand to older adults too. The drug has been in development since 2005, and while this is potentially a groundbreaking discovery, it's still been a long time before a tooth regrowing drug might be available. Optimistically, it could be ready for general use in 2030. There's hoping, here's hoping, the test subjects have much to smile about. And this is from Vice, and it's on DNYUZ. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. Please support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support, and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.